we're going to work on adding and subtracting using the number line. We're going to start with a calculation that you probably did way back when in grade one, but we're going to use it to remind ourselves of the steps. So what we need to do when we need to do a calculation like five, subtract three, we need to see that we're going to start at five. Then we need to know, are we going to go up or down on the number line? If it's subtraction, we'll go down. If it's addition, we're going to be adding, so we'll go up. And then we need to know how many steps we go up or down. And in this case, it'll be down three steps. Let's have a look. We establish our starting point of five, that we're going to go down, and then we start going down our three steps. And we end off at two. So five subtract three gives us two. OK, let's have a look at another calculation. Two subtract eight. Again, we're going to go through the steps of uh, where do we start? Are we going up or down, depending on addition or subtraction, and how many steps? But we don't want to do our eight steps individually. And as we've discussed in the past, instead of going through the eight steps individually, we're going to do a jump to zero um, so that we do the steps in a slightly more efficient way. Let's have a look at how it works. Two subtract eight, we start at two, subtract, so we're going down, and we need to go eight steps down. That's two steps to zero, and we need to go six more steps to make it eight steps in total. And so we end at negative six. So two subtract eight is negative six. What about negative two subtract three? Well, we'll start at negative two, and we've got to go down, and we've got to go down three steps, and that will end us at negative five. So negative two subtract three gives us negative five. What about negative seven plus three? Well, start point is negative seven, but this time, because it's a plus, we're going up, and it's three steps up, which will end us at negative four. Now, how about negative five plus nine? Well, in this case, we start at negative five and we need to go up because we're adding and we need to go up nine steps. We're going to jump five steps to zero. We've got to do four more steps because we want to do nine steps in total. And so we will end up at four. 